Hello everybody, I'm Shuja from Make Tech Easy and today I'll be teaching you how to jailbreak your iOS 7.1 to 7.1.2 device using Pengu. The jailbreak process is fairly simple. There are just a few steps you need to take before you start the process. Before starting, we advise you to update your device to iOS 7.1.2 as it is both compatible with the Pengu jailbreak and contains a lot of bug fixes. We've included the iOS 7.1.2 direct download links in the about section below, so be sure to check that out to get your device up and running on the latest iOS version. We cannot stress the importance of this step. Always make sure you back up your device and data before you tamper with your phone or your tablet. To back up your device using iTunes, simply connect your iOS device to your PC or Mac and click on the Back Up Now button in your device's iTunes tab. Okay, so now on to the actual jailbreak. This guide is both compatible with both Windows and Mac. Before starting, make sure you have the Pangu jailbreak tool on your computer. We have included Pangu's download links below, so get downloading if you don't have it already. So once downloaded, open up Pangu on your PC or Mac. Connect your iOS device and it should appear in the Pangu window. In my case, this is iPad 2.5 with iOS 7.1.2. So once you're ready, click on Jailbreak and you'll be led through a set of instructions to change your device's date to June 2nd, 2014. To do this on your iOS device, open up the Settings app. In general, scroll down to Date and Time. Make sure the Set Automatically option is off and change the date to June 2nd, 2014. Once that's done, your Pangu jailbreak on your Mac will show the status injecting bundles, please wait. Now your device may reboot, mine hasn't, but um, sometimes some devices do. You'll notice you'll have a Pangu jailbreak uh, icon on your iOS device, tap on it. This will open. Keep the device connected and do not close the app. So it's just processing the jailbreak. It's asking us to wait for a few minutes. Now it's rebooting the device. The famous Apple logo. Now you just have to unlock the device. Your device should now reboot again. And with that, the jailbreak is complete. Your device should have successfully jailbreaked. Um, now, this your device will restart. You'll see a couple of welcome messages from the Pangu jailbreak team, and then you'll be off using Cydia. Okay, so once that's done, unlock your device, go forward and you'll find the Cydia icon and congratulations, Cydia is successfully installed. That's it, you'll now have a jailbroken iOS 7.1.2 device. 
feel free to ask about any issues or problems in the comments section below. This is Shuja from Make Tech Easier. Hope you enjoyed the video.